The Dream of the Burning Boy takes place in a high school after the death of a popular student. And it's, it's uh, really about how a secret that comes out after his death changes the lives of everyone around him. And it's about the different ways that people approach the tragedy. It's a very touching and sophisticated play about a group of people uh, coping with something very tragic, but in a way that reveals their the obstacles that they're facing in their lives. It, it has humor, uh, but most of all, it's quite poignant and true. The Dream of the Burning Boy is a, uh, it's a beautiful play about regret and taking responsibility in one's life and uh, not being afraid. In this play, you can kind of see um, within the context of a high school, how people with all sorts of different relationships to this popular student um, are kind of figuring out their own lives in the aftermath of his death. What they get out of this story is finding a way to move on. It's accepting that life is going to have a lot of difficult moments and figuring out how to reach out to other people to find ways to keep going in your life no matter what terrible things come your way. Even though the play is in many ways about um, lost opportunities and guilt and regret and, and somewhat dark themes, uh, there's still a lot of levity and humor throughout the play because I think even in, in maybe especially in painful situations people turn to humor. It's really funny and it's really sad. It's fantastic. Oh.